Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Shelly Geigel with JS Hobbies and Crafts, and I have a free mini album to give away. Um, it's real easy how you enter, and in a moment I am going to bring this closer so you can get a better look at the cover and the inside. Um, I made this with the Rambling Rose paper collection that was designed by Sue Smythe of Ultimate Crafts. And I hope I pronounced her name uh, correctly. It's either Sue Smythe or Sue Smith. And um, this is the cover of the paper pad I used. Um, it's an eight and a half by six and a half with a three and a half inch spine. Um, this is open to outside the United States as well. If you live outside the United States and your name is drawn, I do pay for the package to get to you in your country. However, if your country charges customs or duty fees or anything like that on um, gifts or winnings, you will be responsible for that. I don't pay those. And also, so long as the U.S. Postal Service will deliver to your address, uh, the entry is good. So what do you have to do to enter is uh, you'll want to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so. Uh, you'll also want to share this video to your social media such as share it to your Facebook page or Twitter or um, Instagram, wherever uh, your social media is, Google. So uh, let's take a look at the album and what you can win. And you'll want to make a comment below the video as well. So this is the album up close. I think the lighting over here on my craft desk is a lot better than um, the lighting I had when I was sitting in front of the camera there for you. Uh, anyway, the uh, you can enter up through June 30th, 2017. So make sure you get your entry in there. Uh, again, this was made with the Rambling Rose Paper Collection by Ultimate Crafts. And it is a darker uh, paper. It's eight and a half inch by six and a half inch with a three and a half inch spine. Pretty sure you can see that well enough. And I do have some of the 49th Market flowers on there. And this one I just did uh, is just real simple design, easy, quick put together. So here is the first page, pages. Now picture mats, um, and I will be showing this in my next tutorial, but I used the Cut Mat Create um, uh, dies to do this, and I'm really excited about those. Uh, they make perfect picture mats. Okay, here we go. First page, we do have a fold out, and again, this is just a very simple designed album. And I've got some new dies that I got that I used in here. And those are the Desire dies. And down here. And this is magnetic. And just over here, and that's another one of the new dies I got. Just beautiful. And we got a couple picture mats here. And here we just have two pockets. And you can definitely get some stuff in here if you have memorabilia, you like to put uh, things other than that, newspaper clippings, you'll have plenty of room. I think that die is just gorgeous. And that is the desire. Okay, over here we just have a fold out and I have a little pocket up here. And then there's a place over here to place a photo. And this is another type of die that I got in. It's just a very large pocket, decorated. And over here <clears throat> is just a little spinner here and you can open this up and place photos. Here is um, like a belly band going this way, and I have a couple mats in there. This is magnetic and it does flip up. 
and then this does flip down. And there's a place to plant a nice size pitcher down here and a little pocket down here. Next page is just a pocket, and this is another one of the Desire dies. It's just beautiful. I love them. And we have a 49th Market flower sitting there, and this is just a fold-out. Again, a very simple, easy album uh, I put together here. Here we are, and uh, this just folds out, and it's magnetic. So you can get a photo here, or whatever you'd like. And this does flip up. And it's a large. And then here is a pocket. Oops, I'll leave that out. And then here's the other pocket on the other side. And it looks like I need to tack a little more glue down right there, and I'll do that when I'm done. And the final page, and this is just so you can plan a photo here, and this is something you can slide in and out, and it will hold it. It isn't going to go anywhere. And it's just a little folder to put photos in. Over here is a fold-out, but I do have a pocket. And this folds out, and I also have another folder here. So that's what you can win. And again, entries uh, will be accepted through June 30th, uh, 2017. And then what I'll do is I will draw the lucky winner by July 10th. Remember, there is never any purchase necessary to enter to win any of my um, albums that I create and give away. Um, I have a lot of fun making these albums, so I tend to make quite a bit. Uh, anyway, happy crafting, everybody, and good luck.